this Adobe Illustrator tutorial, we will learn how to create a Halloween in a spooky, goopy style with this slime vector text effect using offset paths, gradients, and various effects. We'll whip up some mucky lettering. Let's get ready. Open the Adobe Illustrator. Here I have used the Adobe Illustrator CC. You can use it, or another, like Adobe Illustrator CS6. In the new layer, take the text tool, and write word scary. Resize, and reposition your text, as you want. And set the font family, alert notice. Now right click on the text, and select create outlines. Then the text outline, will be selected. Click on the window Pathfinder, and in the Pathfinder, panel select Unite. Keep select, the text object, and use, the gradient tool, to apply a linear gradient, of varying greens. For first left, most gradient hex color is, 5 2 DD 0 0, next one is, 6 AF 0 5, next is, C5FF0D, next is, 09FC00, next is, 00B60B, and set the gradient's angle, to minus 88.5. Select the text group, and go to Object, Path, Offset Path. In the Offset Path panel, enable the preview, and set offset value, is 6 pixel, and click OK. Ungroup the offset letters, from the original letters. Select the text group, and set the fill color, to the darkest green, from the gradient. Separate them behind, the original letter group, in the layers panel, copy, and paste your text, and change the fill hex color, to E4FC8C. Place this new group, beneath the main text, but above the offset text group, in the layers panel. Right click on the text, and select arrange, bring to front. Then it will be move, the new text down, and to the right a bit, so it peeks out, from under the main word, of the slime vector text. Using the brush tool, draw dark green shapes all over the letters, to quickly create slices in the lettering. The goal is to make the lettering look like it's wearing away, possibly decomposing. Using the pencil tool again, we're going to draw, additional drizzles of slime. I choose to have the slime drip, on the letter R. Set the fill color, of your slime drips, to dark green as 358900. Using the pencil tool again, we're going to draw, additional drizzles of slime bottom, of the text C, and set the fill color as dark green. Same way you can draw slime drips, around the text as you want. Using the pencil tool, and draw shapes, over the slime vector text drips, that follow their contour, and serve as highlights. I applied a linear gradient of bright green. Hex color is A5F906, at 100% opacity, to dark green, Hex color is 358900, at 0% opacity. I angled the lighter color, of the gradient toward, the roundest part, of the highlight shape. Continue drawing overlapping gradient shapes, on the slime vector text drips.
group together your text components, and then group together your slime drip components. Copy and paste the slime drips, base shapes, and align them with the original slime drip group. Select the copied group, and go to Effect, Stylize, Outer Glow, and apply the following attributes, on the Outer Glow mode, Screen, Color, C1FF160, Opacity 85%, Blur, 0.04 inches, and select OK. Select the Glowing Slime Drip group. Go to Object. Path, Offset Path. In the Offset Path panel, offset the shapes by 3 pixels. Set this offset shapes, Blend Mode to Screen, and Opacity to 53%. Select the Text Group, and go to Effect, Stylize, Outer Glow. In the Outer Glow panel, Set, Mode, Screen. Color rate 4ED14. Opacity 90%, Blur 2.88 pixels. Use the ellipse tool to draw small circles and such around the slime drips. Apply the same fill color gradient, same as the text. And go to Effect, Stylize, Outer Glow, and set the blur, 1 pixel. Now resize the circle, and place I, around the slime drips. Continuously, copy, and paste, this slime component as you want. You can change, the slime component's circle style, by effect, warp, arc. To resize, the slime component's circle go to object, expand appearance. You can place slime drips over the text. Use the rectangle tool to draw a large black rectangle. Right click on the rectangle and go to arrange, send to back, to behind the slime text effect group. You can resize the viewport as your demand. Group all of the text component, by right click on the text, and select group, or press Ctrl plus comma G. Apply a radial gradient, that goes from dark green hex value 359800, at 100% opacity, to black at 0% opacity. Make sure the gradient shape is behind, the main text in the layers panel. Now you can save this text effect as Adobe Illustrator format or export as an image format. With an effect of use of glowing edges, offset paths, gradients, and manipulating text, we've got slimy text and a silly word to ring in the Halloween season. Have a delightfully creepy Halloween and show us your slime vector text effect in the comments below.